Hello everybody, Lone Wolf Rick here. It is Friday, right at 12 noon. I'm walking out of the MGM here through the valet area. And we're getting ready to do a little 20 minute walk for exercise. Today we'll take a look at the uh, hotel room availability for this weekend. I hope everybody's ready for the weekend. I'll have a great weekend. We take a look here where it says valet in case I get lost. Just want to remind everybody of the big show tonight at the Allegiant Stadium. Guns N' Roses makes the return here to Las Vegas. So everybody uh, check that out. I know there's still tickets available. Last weekend, it's like Allegiant Stadium hosted uh, WWE SummerSlam. So they had a couple of snafus where the uh, credit card system went down so hopefully they've got that taken care of and I know it's like the credit card system wasn't just at, uh, at Allegiant Stadium I know the same company that does them also does Petco Field in San Diego and the system went down there it was a whole system wide problem so but hopefully they got it taken care of they got the bugs worked out and they're ready to go for tonight. A couple of other uh, residencies that's, that start this weekend. Morrissey will be at the Caesars Palace. He starts a residency here in Las Vegas. And Santana will be at the House of Blues this weekend as he starts his residency here. So, should be a fairly busy weekend here in Las Vegas. It's going to be a hot one though, so if you're out walking about, please stay hydrated. Uh, they've got ex excessive heat warnings going on through the weekend. I know today's supposed to have a projected high of 109. Uh, at the time I started this video, it was 100 degrees, and uh, tomorrow the projected high is 110, so please stay hydrated. Take care of yourselves there. GM and the Tropicana and properties here on the south end of the Las Vegas Strip. Well, we had all that traffic and then it just died there. It's kind of eerie, huh? Up, oh, but here they come. Well, at least one car. Three, 
freesquare.org. We'll give them a little plug here. Robert Irvine's public house. I'm going to try that one of these days. I've heard it's really good in there. I'll give that a try one of these times. Sorry about that, I was getting my notes out here. So we get ready, we're gonna go over the uh, hotel availability for this weekend and the hotel rates for tonight. So everybody has a rough idea of what's being charged here in Las Vegas. Keep in mind, these hotel rates do not include the approximate $45 a night resort fee uh, that properties charge here in Las Vegas. Some are a little less, some are a little more, but Roughly average about 45 bucks. And they do not include the 13.5% um, hotel room tax either. So kind of keep those in mind as we give these rates out. So the first on our list is the Nomad Hotel, which is part of the Park MGM here. Is six hundred and ten dollars tonight. Caesar Suites is five hundred and three dollars for tonight. The Cosmopolitan Hotel four hundred dollars. The Four Seasons three hundred and ninety-five dollars. The Waldorf Astoria three hundred and 
$385. The Crockford Hotel, part of Resort World, $379. The Wynn and the Encore are both $339. The Delano, which is part of uh, hey guys, did you get one of, these? of Mandalay Bay, is $324. The Cromwell, $284. Mandalay Bay, $274. The M, on the very south end of the Las Vegas Strip, is $234. The Bellagio is $229. Caesars Palace, just the regular rooms, $218. The Aria, $209. The Virgin Hotel on Paradise Road is $200. The Vidara is $193. The Stratosphere is $190. The MGM is $182. The Weston Hotel is $179. The Park MGM is $169. The South Point Hotel, which is on the south end of Las Vegas Boulevard, $161. The Conrad, $160. New York, New York, $159. The Mirage Hotel is $159. Treasure Island, $157. The Las Vegas Hilton, $153. Planet Hollywood is $132. The Paris Hotel is $129. The Luxor Hotel is $126. The Sahara Hotel on the north end of the Strip is $118. The Westgate on Paradise Road is $116. The Flamingo Hotel is $105. The Link, $104. The Tropicana is $103. The Excalibur Hotel, $99. Harris Hotel, $96. Valley's Hotel is $89. The Oyo Hotel is $85. And Circus Circus is $81. So that takes care of the properties that are on the Strip or near the Strip Hotel. Let's take a look at the ones downtown on or off of Fremont Street. We'll take a look at the Eminem guides here. The Fremont Hotel is $189. The D is $152 for tonight. The California Hotel is $142. The Four Queens is $130. The Golden Nugget is $122. The El Cortez is $107. And the downtown Grand is $104. So the prop that's the takes care of uh, Fremont Street, the properties that I could get rates on. Now let's take a look at the ones off the strip and around town here. Green Valley Ranch is $274. The Red Rock Hotel is $179. The Silverton is $149. Sunset Station is $143. The Suncoast Hotel in Summerlin is $121. The Orleans Hotel off of Tropicana is $118. The Gold Coast Hotel is $107. Okay, hey, there's no light at Denny's. The Rio Hotel is $104.
Boulder Station is $98 and the Santa Fe Hotel is $98 also. All right, so that takes care of the hotel rates uh, for tonight and the availability for the weekend. Now keep in mind, all these rates were got or uh, were, were getting. <laughs> I got them all off of uh, Hotels.com. I got them all. I got them all off of Hotels.com. So if you're planning on coming short notice here. It's like it give you a rough idea of what the prices are. And uh, so be sure to check them out uh, before you leave, before you get here, because rates in Las Vegas, especially on the weekends, have a, have a uh, tendency to fluctuate. Pretty good crowd of people walking around today here, considering how hot it is and and how uh, you know Friday usually people check in a little bit later, so that's good to see all the people out and about. All right, everybody, I think that's gonna do it for today's video. We, I thank you very much for joining us. We greatly appreciate it. Everybody, uh, take care. Have a nice, safe weekend, okay?
If you're new to the channel, hit that red subscribe button. We greatly appreciate that. And to our subscribers, thank you very much for your support. We greatly appreciate that also. Everybody take care, okay? Stay healthy, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.